Of course, we are with Kenneth John Montegrande. Kung nakikita nyo yan, yan. Uh, distinctly, he is the only Southeast Asian artist na na-collect ni Maizawa. Kilalang, na kilalang collector ng Japanese. He is an international collector, mm -hmm. well-known collector, worldwide basically. He owned uh, uh, some of the most expensive paintings in the world, such as uh, yeah, my, my basket siya, yun yung pinaka-latest tanda niya. 110.5 million US dollars. Saka ikaw lang yung first Filipino and first Southeast Asian artist na na-collect. Fortunately, yun yung sinabi nila. Mm -hmm. And this is your pang ilang solo exhibit? Um, this uh, 10 solo exhibit, yeah. Mm -hmm. Si Kenneth kasi, I added him on, on Facebook kasi na-impress ako sa work niya. Ako yung na-impress. It so happened na meron kaming common friends na taga-media din. Yeah. Then ako yung nag-offer na ipi-feature ko siya. <laughs> Very seldom. No? Yung iba kasi, they asked me to do it. This time, that time, ako yung nagsabi na akong gagawa. Because very impressive. Nakita niyo naman yung trabaho niya. Ayan. And today, I, I saw na somebody just bought your painting. Kanina. Yung kanina. Thank God all of the paintings are, were sold. Yun naman sabi ko, and thanks to all the collectors to all. Thanks also sa uh, the owners of, owner of the Gallery of Akil, uh, UP Town Center and all. Plus uh, the team, so the Gallery of Akil, they did a great job, especially the ones that uh, contribute to the Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you now. Okay. So, sabi ni Kenneth, artist din siya. She's also an artist, uh, Dr. Dr. Amin Lin Wong. So, why, don't, why don't we go around your work na very impressive? Yeah. This so, one, the title of this one, uh -huh. this life goes on, so as you can see, there's a water, it's a very river actually. Mm -hmm. And then clouds in there, on the, uh, on the side, there's a rock mountain. So basically, uh, why is it life goes on? Parang, you know, so why not? Tuloy tuloy lang talaga tayo, whatever happens, ups and down. So just, do your thing, just appreciate everything, and then that's it. So, one of the good images thinking, aside from the river and then the rock mountains, uh, from afar, because um, at the end, um, we, I actually, every time I paint, and then I give a title, and then I uh, contemplate the title as the meaning of the baby. So, nung before, na, na, ano mo naman, life goes on. Pero, uh, later on, habang tinitignan ko siya, may si Jesus Christ is nandito. The crucifix. So, nandito siya. So, from afar, medyo oh. yung mga na yung mga na yung mga na yung mga na. Oh. And then, yung pinigin niya yung Jesus. So, since I've stopped, I've stopped. So, if God is with you, dito na lang ang buhay. And the other one is very colorful. Okay, dito. <laughs> Yeah, the yeah, title yeah, so is Life is Beautiful. Life is uh, Beautiful Beyond Nature. So, you know, very colorful and boring. Ako, I know how you get your inspiration because out of your experiences, out of, yeah, out of your uh, faith. Not, not only my own experience, but mm -hmm. of course, everyone, all of us, the bad and the bad, the problem, different kinds of experiences and experience happen sa buhay ko. Just like that, so, um, just keep with this, ano eh, keep with this, appreciate everything. And even in the darkest moment, appreciate. Once you appreciate everything, makikita mo yung positive side ng no situation. That's yeah. the basically yeah. the keys of my Sa mga hindi pala nakakalam, si Ken is also a businessman at uh, matulungin po siya. Yung sa nangyari sa Tael, nandun sila. Yeah, um, well, given, ano lang eh, given it will be given to you, sa uh -huh. so, This one is very inspiring. <coughs> armor of God. This one is Armor of God, so 
kung nakita mo, so sabi nung may, may isang verse, verse of the Bible, na always wear the armor of God para, bakit? Kasi para, yung attack ng kalaban, we are always protected with the, the attack of the enemies. Diba? So, this one, in my opinion, this one is abstract expressionism. Mm -hmm. But later on, naging in between ng expressionism and impressionism. Why? Because, you can there's an armor here. Yeah. Right. But, wearing the armor, diba? once na nasa tayo, battle, oh. ano ba sila sa natin? He's riding me a horse, uh, ready to fight. One of my favorites actually. Uh, sa mga hindi pa nakakalam pala, two, two weeks ago I was in Qatar. <laughs> I was so surprised kasi sinabi sa akin na kasi may sculptor doon na ang medium naman niya is mga timidor, kutsara, Filipino si Danny Ponce. Tapos sabi nila na there's another Filipino artist that, that you should be here. That should be here. Then tinanong ko si, no, at that time nag, magka-PM kami ni Kenneth. Sabi nila, si Kenneth Montegrande. What? <laughs> Surprisingly, they, they remember my name. Yeah. Lang, actually, I was supposed to be part of the um, Qatar Art Fair. Mm -hmm. So, the Department of Tourism of Qatar mm -hmm. uh, invited me actually. But, uh, sa atin lang, it didn't materialize because yung sa preparations, plus during the time that they approached me, medyo close na dun sa deadline nila. And the problem is, meron akong preparation for my nine solo exhibit dun sa Manila Art. That, time. that was last year, in November. So, yun. Since approved ka na, they are still waiting for you. Well, I'm willing and uh, very happy glad to you know, share my artworks. Yun naman ang ano natin eh, to everyone. Imagine talagang gulat ka. <laughs> He's my friend. <laughs> Ayun, so, And congratulations kasi yung mga uh, hindi naman lahat na pipili eh. Hmm. Diba? So yeah, this uh, some of the new series and uh, uh -huh. art works. Uh, basically this one is a uh, combination of uh, landscape, landscape and uh, 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 waterscape series. So under the Trinity series, but uh, I want it to more like more dramatic. <clears throat> Not a typical landscape or cloudscape or uh, water series. No? So yung major poetic and the major parang some of the viewers they they look at it as parang uh, but uh, some of it naman <clears throat> yung calmness nando uh -huh. major dark. So It's a mixed emotions, mm -hmm. combination of feelings. So, dito lang iba, white naman yung background, black. Ano this pa rin siya? Uh, this one is a landscape and cloudscape naman. Mm -hmm. So, if you can see from afar, there's a flat, basically, yung, 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 yung suposo, or yung ulit ang pan. Mm -hmm. And there's a rocks here, if you look at it. Uh -huh. This one, yeah. The landscape nai, so may konti pa nga, kasi yung lighting door, medyo dark inside. Ito parang, parang uh, doomsday na day. Mm. But of course, uh, it depends on sa pagkapit. But for me, it's very calmness. It's, very it's calmness. And okay. 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 And of course, he... This is uh, Dr. John David Bayon. Of course. From, uh, from uh, De La Salle. De La Salle University of Papi. And he is uh, one of my best friend brother and then uh, one, the owner of my book, Coming Soon. Okay. At saka, no, uh, he started yung popularity mo. Saan mo? Di ba? When it comes to the... Hindi niya amin niyan. Yeah. Publicity niya. And then we actually uh, DLSU Publishing lately uh, last uh, last month mm -hmm. the um, uh, published book siya nga it's a collaboration of uh, parang I saw a copy of that kanina as a new copy oh okay and um, DLSU University sir 
Professor, my pleasure to meet you. My pleasure to meet you. Hello. Yep, bye bye. See you. And this one. These are some of the some of the series of my cloudscapes. Uh -huh. So Midnight Blue series. There's another one that I um, released last year, but it's under the Trinity series, meaning my clouds, my landscape, and my own, uh, water at that time. So, so we can sa kanyang painting yung Trinity is cloud, yeah. water, and. But in the Bible, you see the uh, Trinity is the Father. Yes. So, and the Holy Spirit. But this one, just for me, mm -hmm. I mean, the Trinity is like the, um, wait, the, the clouds, the water, and then the land. Without, without the missing is a giant. Incomplete. Eh. No. So, so, so yun. Sa mga makapanood nito, alam nyo na ano yung ibig sabihin nyo sa painting ni Ken, yung Trinity. 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 Ang lalaki ng paintings mo, Ken, parang how long would it take you to finish one? Sa... Masakit sa balikat. Oh yeah, itong when it comes to ano talaga. So, gang, especially yung mga big, yung mga big sizes. Mm -hmm. um, it depends. Uh, depends sa mood eh. Talagang you, you can say na kailangan kaya nang taposin ang ilang araw. There are some paintings. Ah, uh, yung ito, average na. There are some, well, at least in a week. Hopefully, makatapos ako na isa. Ngayon eh, kapag sinapiyan ka na yung spirit ng, <laughs> alam mo yun, eh, ng, for the six feet, so I think there are 13, ba? 13? Yeah, I, we, I prepared 13 uh, pieces. So, I don't know, may 3 by 2 by 2, 3 by 3, mayroong 4 by 4. So, ito yung pinakamalaki. No, those are. Uh, those that one. Yes, that one. one. Yung light is beautiful. The second one, that one is uh, 4 by 6. Oh. 4 by 6, that one. So dito sa Soul Exhibit na to, uh, 13 pieces, how long did it take you to finish them all? I was starting to prepare this um, uh, paintings na to since last year. So it's almost like a couple of months before ko natapos. But majority, uh, some of the paintings that I displayed here, natapos ko siya ng lately lang. So kasi when you paint kasi, dyan mo na yan. And then another mood, ito na naman, set ng another mood, ito na naman. So until you finish yung isa, 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 isa. One at a time eh. So most of them, I, I natapos ko nitong this year lang, January. Okay. Sa mga hindi nakakalam din, si Ken is used to be a media practitioner. <laughs> yeah, I... I used to be a yeah, it's there. full time journalist. Uh -oh. And then I used to be a. And then I shifted away to PR. Uh -oh. And then I used to be a, a, a spokesperson of the Department of Tourism for the National Parks mm -hmm. Development Committee. And then finally, way back in 2014, I decided to resign. And then uh, 2012, because I was not to be a new interest. Ko, I mean. And then uh, I put up my own business again, which is events and PR. And then running it for a couple of years. And then uh, because of the painting, totally I give up everything. And then I decided to be a full-time, or full pledge, a full-time artist. Um, but on the side, um, I still decided to open up mass of new ventures like yung I'm into water refilling station business mm -hmm. laundry coffee shop uh, but uh, someone managed uh, somebody's managing the business uh, like yun nga may mga kaibigan tayo may mga kasama tayo na nag may mga manage yun ako lang supervision mm -hmm. um, you, know, you know typical na no on the top ka lang so Mm -hmm. But I, I, I make sure that uh, painting is the uh, my uh, 
top of my priority. Yeah, you find it most fulfilling. Yeah, really, really, I'm really happy with what I'm doing right now. So, mm -hmm. iba yung, iba yung, uh, what do you call this, yung uh, happiness, you know, yung uh, inner, you know, compared to sa, of course, being a journalist, is, it's a normal profession. Mm -hmm. Being a PR, ganun din, I mean, uh, I really enjoyed my years. Being a PR, uh, journalist, PR, spokesman, businessman, but uh, iba yung happiness na nakukuha ko when it comes to sa pain. Oh. Wala ka bang ano, separation anxiety? Kasi ibang artists, pag they don't want to part with their work, sa'yo, pag syempre natapos mo yan, tapos somebody would own it na. Okay, well, well um, I admire my works. Mm -hmm. I really love to keep my works sana. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, first thing, wala naman akong malaking space for me to have my artworks. Mm -hmm. And then I believe din kasi uh, this talent has to feeling, be shared. Binigay ni Gadya. Sabi niya, sabi niya, diba? If you have talent, explore. Explore ng talent mo. Mm -hmm. Practice. And then share it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yung talent mo, if it's if you keep it sa you lang, parang it's nonsense. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I, th that's my. Mm, kasi my, meron parable of the oh, talents it's, it's, eh, it's better to share it. It's better to to show it to the world. Share it to the people who really appreciates works. And then, kasi it will give happiness also with uh, those people. Eh. I, don't, I don't know if it's uh, for me. That's that's basically. Uh, it will give inspiration, inspirations to sa ibang tao. So once they saw your works, see your works, uh, may something na nag, alam mo yung, yung affections with the artwork. Ito as an artist, may affection ka dun sa gawa mo. For sure, other people who can also appreciate arts, art. Iba yung dating din sa kanila. No? And it's priceless. And you can, hindi mo pwede ipagdamot sa kanila yun. Something like that. So, okay, so this runs until February 10th. Oh yeah, oh. Uh, this one, um, tonight is the artist uh, reception. It was started actually last February 1. Mm -hmm. Last until February 10th. Mm -hmm. So for those uh, um, uh, art enthusiasts, Collectors, you can uh, still uh, see some of my artworks here, and then uh, you know, picture. Mm -hmm. you, you can you can you can uh, follow me on uh, yeah. uh, Facebook and yeah, Jack Monte Grande, and then add me palas Facebook, and then follow me on uh, Instagram. Instagram. So, marami kaling followers uh, don. It's a the art of Kenneth Monte Grande, mm -hmm. and if you also have. I also have YouTube. I okay. started to uh, be a vlogger. So all of my what I know is uh, social my, media platforms. Uh, I'm doing I'm doing a document and then I I post it in as a download it on YouTube. Ko. La Quachero artist. So <laughs> please subscribe and uh, and click the button, <laughs> the like button. Subscribe. Like oh, yeah. Para nasa ganon. Every time that uh, may post ako. Oh. Oh. oh, yeah. Oh. So, what's next after this? Uh, next time, yeah. I have a, I have a piece. I have pieces that are going to display art in Philippines. That will be this this month, February, February twenty first. Something like that. I forget the date, but uh, it's in Makati. It's art in Philippines. Ah, yeah, that one. And then after that, another group exhibit. With uh, Jacob Sundi, mm -hmm. uh, uh, Gallery Anna, mm -hmm. so, as a mega mall, mm -hmm. duo, group show. And then after that, May naman, meron pa na, uh, that's, that's a May. And then meron pa na, most of the exhibits this year is our, next year, this year, I mean, uh, poor group exhibit. So hopefully, hopefully, Another solo show, maybe on uh, October, November. Super, November. super busy. That will be for a boss. 
Oh, uh, okay. And probably yung Qatar matutuloy na. Oh, ah, yeah, um, if um, well, basically si Qatar, no, Qatar Department of Tourism ni Qatar, na mm -hmm. uh, emailed me already, and uh, they asked me for, I mean, they, we have a series of communications, so hopefully magmaterialize. Uh, so, okay, congratulations again. Thank you, po. Salamat po. No way. All right. Congratulations. Hi, thank you. <laughs>